discover and control an exciting world of resonance. Meet Noisy, a synthesizer with a brand new take on synthesis based on the principle of acoustic resonance. It was designed to generate highly playable, multidimensional, expressive sounds with textures and articulations that anyone can easily combine and manipulate. Let's dive right into it. Noisy produces sound using a physical modeling concept derived from the world of acoustic instruments, string vibration. When you hit the string of, let's say, a guitar, it starts vibrating. This natural vibration diffuses progressively and then gently dissipates. You'd say that the string has entered into resonance. It's this resonance that produces such acoustic timbres with the organic natural behavior. They are not static, they vividly modulate over time. Noisy has been specifically built around the phenomenon of resonance. Each of its two sound layers features three resonators. To excite these resonators, we use noise. Noise carries energy across a broad frequency spectrum and has no perceivable pitch. This changes once it enters the tuned resonators. It's a bit like a hand that would strike or pluck a guitar string. By its nature, noise is very dynamic and constantly moving. Its random behavior brings unique character to the sound. For maximum sonic flexibility, each of Noise's resonators has an electronic and an acoustic aspect. For the electronic aspect, the physical principle of resonance has been extracted and applied to traditional oscillators with classic waveforms. This results in what we call resonant oscillators, a brand new synthesis concept allowing for unique vivid tones with ultra-low alias. The resonant oscillator's waveform can be morphed continuously using the resonator's matrix. And the oscillator resonance knob lets you adjust the resonance time to your liking. The acoustic aspect emanates from comb filter technology that was optimized to take full advantage of its unique timbres reminiscent of plucked string sounds. From the harmonization of timbres to the balancing of resonances, everything has been done to provide the best musical experience possible, regardless of the pitch played. For the comb filter's resonance knob, we integrated an acoustic dampening system that lets you explore a wide palette of tones. The more you turn the knob to the right, the more your sound is enriched with even harmonics close to a guitar's character. Conversely, when turning it to the left, odd harmonics are added, which will give you a harp-like tone. Crossfader then allows to seamlessly blend between the comb filter and resonant oscillators for a perfect mix. Another crucial aspect of the philosophy behind Noisy is that each main preset is actually a multi-dimensional sound. Every preset can be manipulated via four distinct dimensions of sound design, each of which can be used on its own or combined harmoniously with the others via a system of four expression markers. But exploration doesn't stop there. It all makes even more sense with Noisy's preset system. Noisy's browser gives you access to hundreds of carefully designed multidimensional presets. Now imagine that you can combine the individual sound dimensions of different presets with each other. This is where the sub-preset system comes into play. Each main preset is actually made up of two sub-presets that are distinctly stored as layer presets. Let's say I like the swell sound playing in the background of this lead sound. I can then just add its sonic dimension to my lead by replacing the lead's second layer. This system opens up a virtually unlimited amount of options for sonic creations without the need to dig deep into synth programming. Still, if you want to engage in programming your own multidimensional sounds, we pursue a unique approach to that as well. With a lot of conventional synths, creating vivid sounds is a tedious task involving lots of editing phases. Not so with Noisy. Let me show you what I mean by having a look at its modulation system. It all starts with two simple modulation blocks per layer. An expression block that combines an envelope with a continuous control macro and an LFO block with a selection of traditional waveforms. Every synthesis block that qualifies as a modulation target then has its own modulation panel easily recognizable in the blink of an eye. 
It lets you adjust the modulations and detail, while a system of visual cues helps you comprehend what's going on under the hood. Let's set up an example starting with the first resonator's waveform matrix. Upon each key stroke, the envelope from the expression block is triggered. Right now it's only working as an amp envelope reacting to velocity. To make it affect another parameter, just use the first of the three knobs of any modulation panel, the expression amount. This one here belongs to the y-axis of the matrix. It lets the envelope signal morph the waveform between a simple sine tone and a brighter shape with more harmonics. The purple line indicates its modulation range. The second knob in every modulation tab is the LFO range. This one here is associated with the x-axis, letting the waveform morph along different bright waveforms. Its range is represented by a blue line. By using the third knob, called Expression Mod, you can dynamically modulate the LFO range with the expression signal. If we apply a negative amount here, the LFO movement starts wandering towards the triangle shape on the left, or towards the sign at the top when using the same knob for the y-axis. It's easy to bring in a lot of color and motion with noises modulation panels. Right now though, we're still listening to one single resonator. To thicken our sound, we'll add resonators 2 and 3, each with their own settings. Expression is all about continuous real-time changes to your sound. Therefore, we added an expressive control macro that works wonders, for example when mapped to a hardware controller. The envelope we used until now is in fact added on top of that macro, so in order to hear the macro's effect isolated, let's fold down the envelope to a mere short trigger and give it a go. As you can hear, all the cool morphing that we had set up using the envelope equally reacts to the continuous control signal. The sound follows our every little movement and is progressively changing intensity and brightness, although we haven't even used the filter yet. Noisy does come with a great sounding filter though. To have a listen, let's use the expression signal to control its cutoff frequency. It's perfect to illustrate another new useful feature we implemented, called Rise and Fall. Rise and Fall basically is an additional envelope that can be applied and adapted for each synthesis block individually, all accessible with a simple click. Every expression amount knob has two sliders next to it. Rise increases the attack time of the modulation, adding a kind of inertia to the way the expression module manipulates a parameter. Fall lets your expression signal persist longer, increasing the release time. Rise and Fall thus allow for a super quick yet detailed adjustment of modulations, especially useful to make them respond to your gestures in a natural way. We've seen how intuitive it is to make your sound come alive and react to your expression with just a few clicks. The strength of Noise's modulation system also resides in the way that things are optimized behind the scenes. Hidden sensitivity curves and ranges are continuously scaled in the background for every single parameter. This maintains great dynamics without things going overboard, and it saves you from ending up with modulation dead zones. All this makes sound design a fluid, intuitive experience. Let's move on to the effects section. Noise's effects page is shared by both layers. It not only can polish your sound, but also carries forward our clever modulation system for expressive articulations. For this, the effects page has its own two dedicated expression macros optimized for continuous control. Two expressive effect slots are there to accentuate and dynamize your track. They offer a tool set of algorithms ideal for creating sound variations that are handy for impressive breaks, exciting transitions and big drops. A delay and a reverb top off the effects page. The delay features modulation, filtering and panning options to embellish your sound with resonating stereo echoes.
The reverb is an authentic reproduction of our plate rhythm. We made sure that every parameter on the effects page can be modulated in real time without producing any glitches. That way, you can smoothly go from a bit of realistic ambience to placing your sound in a vast, surreal space with infinite luscious reverberation. As we've seen, Noisy was made from day one with sound designers in mind. From its clever modulation system to its innovative expressive effects section, everything was optimized to facilitate your creative workflow, giving you new perspectives on multidimensional sound design. Start experimenting now. Answer noisy.